Uh, everything fits in to the draw then. We already know that Li Shi Feng and uh, Anthony Ginting both through for the second round. And Ginting will play the winner of this upcoming match on the show called Popov versus Shrikan. My name's Trevor Harris, alongside me uh, in the commentary box of Steen Pedersen. Time of pop-off there, Steen's going to have home support, obviously. Not sure it's going to be enough. He's not got a great recent record against the Indian. Well, he won the very first encounter uh, some years ago, but since then, uh, she can't pass that the uh, upper hand. Big man, pop-off, six foot four, he's something of a giant. Can following him onto court. So often we see players just get a lift playing on home soil, and he's going to need one if he's going to topple 30 year old Kidan Bishrikan. And the red. Former world number one, of course. There you see that head to head. That first meeting that Bob Bob won was two and a half years ago. Since then, he's lost the you last three, the last of which took barely half an hour. Twenty-five years of age now, Popov. He's uh, ranked thirty-five in the uh, sorry, twenty-five in the world. He was twenty-one last November, so just about a year ago. That high ranking. Of course, his dad's a former national player. First, really came to prominence when he won the European Junior Championships uh, way back in 2017. And his biggest win to date was the Spain Masters. That's the Super 300. A couple of years ago, he's also won three Super 100 titles. And his opponent, from India, 30 years of age, number one back in uh, April of 2018. He's got a World Championship silver. He's got a Commonwealth Games bronze. Only actually, it's surprising, he made one World Tour final. He lost to... Victor Appleson in India a few years back. He has won six Super Series events, including the French Open way back in 2017. And of course, he was a member of that Thomas Cup winning team in Bangkok as well. So just about finished the knock-up. Ready to play. So, shoelace is sorted. And a bit of a drink. Choose your weapon. Should be underway very shortly. It's his first uh, singles match of the day on the show court. Oh, 
player introductions upcoming. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Toma Junior Popov, France. And on my left, Kidabi Srikan, India. Kidabi Srikan to serve, love all, play. So where we go. Men's singles. There's a, a nice start for Shrikan. One love. He's always had a lovely touch, Dean. I've always thought he's a lovely player to watch. Yeah, Shrikan? Yep. Yeah. Elegant in his attack. Service over. One all. I think this is one of the uh, matches where you, as you mentioned, playing on home soil and uh, coming off um, a rather good win Service last over. week where Toma Popo beat the uh, Asian Games gold medalist Li Xifeng in the uh, very first round. This is one of the matches where you hope you can um, make something happen. Popov has uh, raw power. Two, three. The problem you might have is that Shrikanth is a, he's a wily old fox, isn't he? And they're both players that um, rely on the um, attacking game. Three, all. And um, there could be a, a huge battle for the uh, initiative on the front court here. Service over. Four, from a Shrikant's point of view because he moved his man around the court quite nicely in that rally. Yeah. He made the error. There's also something that where he needs to register and what kind of playing conditions is it uh, that we have here in uh, Glass Arena in Wren. Is he playing the fast side perhaps? That's definitely one of the questions that he'll ask himself. Clean winner, right onto the sideline from Popov. There's the Service pass. over. Three count. Five all. Yeah, it's got on, on the front court. This man here, he puts a lot of small deceptions in his shot, even from uh, below the tape level. Got some early Service indications Six, on uh, five. potential drift in here. Still too early to uh, make any conclusions, but uh, didn't look like he was applying too much power, which we can.
Kokovic. We can see it's uh, Matthias Bull. The uh, Dane, who is um, mostly coaching the doubles uh, for India, is uh, on the chair of uh, Shrikant. Interesting to see what he can come up with if he can help them uh, from number one. Well, it's been uh, an intriguing first Seven, few minutes here, six. kind of punch and counter punch from Popov and Kadambi. Three mistakes on the back Service line. Over. Seven all. I'm not sure he minds too much, um, Shrikant, because he's an attacking player, so he should have an advantage against an average player in um, Service windy over. conditions, and especially fast playing Eight, conditions. Toma Popov, seven. he's also an attacking player. He's um, physically very strong, and I think uh, a bit slower playing conditions would have um, suited him well. Oi! Oh. <laughs> That's brilliant for Kid Abby. Won the little net battle, seven. which set up the opportunity, but still. A lot to do with that backhand, brilliant. Jump, backhand smash with a full pirouette. Degree of difficulty, yeah. high. Artistic <laughs> impression. <laughs> Had everything. See the little deception gives Shrikant the initiative. Service over. He was instrumental, Nine. the Indian, in um, the Tom's Cup victory last year, where India very surprisingly uh, won the World Championship for men's team, won all his uh, second men's singles on that occasion. Play. Service over. Attacking Ten, back eight. against uh, the same site where Popo came from. He just orchestrated the rally, didn't he, to be the way that he wanted it to be. So. A three-point lead then 11, for the Indians eight, to go for the mid-game break. 11-7, Kadambi in front. 11-8, rather, Kadambi in front.
Service over. 9-11. Good pressure there from... Uh, 10 Eleven. Someone pull Paul. It was the shot from Shrikhand that he intercepted, and I think it's important for Popov to uh, stand his ground. Service over. The front court here. Twelve, ten. Shrikhand hit three errors on the back court already in the first part of uh, this game here. So um, I think Popov needs to leave that a little bit open and focus on uh, challenging Shrikhand on the front court. Well, that's top class stuff from uh, Kajambi. Even though Popov's been moving really well, he covers a lot of ground, but yeah. he was absolutely powerless to anything about that. Yeah, I think he missed it and was called out. Was it? Yeah. I was surprised to see a challenge, but let's see who. Oh, oh it maybe was it was, yeah, just a fraction. 13. Wait, 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 wait. Oi, the rally is going on, but the umpire is not ready. What's going on now? Come here, please. No. I didn't say the score before you started playing, before saying the score. So we need to play again. We need to yeah, play just again. making the point, she needs to say the score yes. after every play point right. before we we'll get the serve in play. So, 11, 12. Yeah, the thing is that um, Play. maybe I didn't hear it correctly, but I think she called wait, 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 instead of calling it let, which is the uh, correct term. Who gets the second chance in this round and he wins it. Well, all. It's deceptively quick around the court, isn't he, Pop Bobby? He, he moves really well. It's a big bam, but he's pretty agile. Conception that then over a certain height you were probably too tall to become a men's singles player. I think uh, someone Popov uh, and uh, especially Victor Axelsen have um, proved that wrong. But you need to do your uh, agility work. Play. Because it is demanding to play men's singles. Lots of uh, stop and go, lots of uh, defensive movements in the legs. Very quickly onto that. Yeah, and instead of, um, if we go back to that uh, rally where the umpire called it let, that would have uh, seen Shrikhan go up 13-11, now he's down 12-14 instead. Lost all three rallies since then. Ooh. Service well. over. 13-14. Could be that it's not that drifty after all, but the shuttle's just fast. That's an amazing lift. Excellent. Service over. 15, 13. Well, crowd are engaged. Popov's taking some energy from them as well. Just a uh, little glimmer here, 15-13. 
especially now. Thank you. 16, 13. Play. Totally off the ball, Shrikant. Um, lost six of the last seven points. So chances here now for Popov. Fault. Service over. 14 17. Again, successful body smash 15, from uh, Shrikhan. 17. This challenge for the taller players to cover the body attack well. Yeah, it was right. Right at the hit, wasn't it, of uh, Popov. Couldn't do anything about it. Oi! He had no business winning that one, Shrikhan. 16, 17. Defended the body well. That one should have been a kill. It was in super position to my Popov at the net. But so quickly, Thank he you. picks up on it. Uh, Shrikhan notices that there's going to be a chance for counter-attacking. 17. This is father and coach. So he's got himself right back into this. If he can. Oh. Service over. 18 16. Well, as much instinct as anything else, but he'll certainly take it. Beautiful shot in the end. We'll lead back to two. Service over. 17, 18. Also well defended by Popov. Shrikant link first, and Popov within a couple of points 19, now. 17. Well, taking no. this opener. Thank you, back and forth. Stood his ground well on the front court there. Tom and Popov. Quick, please. Everything that Shrikan came with was covered well. Thank
Well, the crowd, crowd really reacted to that. Game point, 70. And he's got three chances here, Popov, to take this opener. Uh, that was super defensive work by uh, the tall man. to 17 and it's a great First start for Popov whether he can sustain it not a matter entirely but just what the crowd wanted 20 minutes here Popov leads one game to love Court one, 20 seconds. Court one, 20 seconds. So what can Kidan be fine then? Second game, Laval, play. Yeah, I think we'll see him uh, in some of the style we see here where he's trying to make the court big for uh, Toma Popov feeling that if there's any drift then uh, he's trying to uh, uh, then uh, Shrikant is playing up against it wide. well very resilient One in that rally pop off and showing uh, some impressive judgment as well flies faster from Tomopoho's side to Watts. Shrikan. So it's easier for Shrikan to uh, play the back line with quality. 
But he seems to have trouble with the sidelines. Service over. Yeah, a couple of Two, sloppy errors one. from the Indian. Doesn't want to give any more encouragement to uh, Toma Popov. Well, it was a late decision by the Frenchman to play the shuffle a couple Service of shots over. before. Shrikant put two it away very easily. On. Yeah, that was the one. Didn't leave it and yeah. way too late. Look how short it was. The first attack uh, Shrikant played. That's why the late decision hurt. Uh, Toma Popov couldn't get it all the way to the back line. Wait, that's a great service return. Service over. Three, two. Toma, wait for the Service over. Strong play from Shrikant with a Three, broken racket. Four. Or rather with a broken string. I think the racket went in the uh, first smash and the follow-up was played with um, a broken string. Look how uh, far back the strings go when they break. Amazing he hit that wind as well as he did. Yeah. Thank you. Back on court. Back on court. Dabby, Dabby, three, four. Over. Five, but he won't mind a few of those, three. normal the crowd, obviously. Oh, we did it. Yeah, he's, he's made too many errors, uh, Shrikant, especially on the sidelines. of um, Toma Popov here in this second game is uh, sideline errors from uh, the Indian. And there's another one. Yeah, and he can't really play himself into a good Seven, situation. Uh, Toma Popov uh, has got him covered in uh, the patient game. Not been given a chance uh, to close in on the net and utilize his uh, great touch there. Brilliant.
It's actually only three spots between them in the rankings now. Not sure that tells the whole story, bearing in mind where Shrikan has been in terms of uh, the official positions up at number one but five years ago initially. And he's made a great start here, 8-3 having won the first game. Service over, 4-8. Service over, 9-4. Just long. Service over. Five, nine. Yeah. This time it was well placed. He got to it, uh, Toma Popov. So, um, It's fair enough that uh, Shrikan goes close to the lines, but he needs to um, make fewer mistakes on them if he's to come back in this match, I think. Six, nine. Service over. Ten, six. Well, one step forward and one back at the moment for uh, Shrikan. So, 11, a handy lead again for Popov, who's in control here. 11-7 at the mid-game break. Court one, 20 seconds. Court one, 20 seconds. Thank you, coach. Coach, return to your turkey. Kidabi. 
Give the shuttle to the service jazz, please. Don't throw the shuttle, give the shuttle. 11, seven, play. So Shrikan has to make something happen here and fairly quickly. So far, 12, seven. he hasn't uh, shown anything that um, sort of supports that uh, he should be able to come back. There's a little twist in this, um, I'm not necessarily in this match for Toma Popo, but it's, it's more important than just a first round match. We're in the Olympic qualification seven. period, and he's in a tough battle with his kid brother for a spot in the Paris Olympics. At the moment, Krista Popov is uh, uh, approximately 400 points ahead of um, Toma. Both got um, nearly 40,000 points, and it's 400 points. That's the difference between them. And uh, yesterday, Krista Popov Eight, lost to uh, the former world champion, uh, Lokin Yu. So, if Toma wins this match here, then he will um, go back in front as the highest ranked uh, French player in the Olympic qualification. They also play men's doubles. Service play men's over. doubles later, don't they, today? Yeah, yeah. 14, the last match here. Eight. And um, they have a chance of qualifying in men's doubles as well. But they're in a tough battle with um, another French pair, uh, Lucas Cové and Juan uh, Labar. Service over. I am curious how much, Nine, if at 14. all, they talk about that kind of rivalry for the Olympic spot. <laughs> yeah. Is it just kind of just nothing said, or it's do fine. they? I don't know. Play on. Anyhow, he's got a nice lead here. There's Thomas. Defense. Oh. 10 14. Lovely subtlety about that shot from Shri Anthony. He is one of those players who's capable of getting a run of points going. Yeah, because if, if suddenly the shots that have been just outside the line, if suddenly they start kissing the lines, then there's a lot of points in for him. And um, if you're an attacking player and go on a roll, then. Um, can score quick points in succession. Yeah, he'll be right back in business. Late decision to play that. Yeah. It's gone long. Service over. 15 10. Play. Great pick up, wasn't it, from Pop Pop to make Shrikant play another shot. 16. And he could get a factor winner. He looked to be in, in uh, reasonably good shape in, uh, in Denmark, Shrikant. He was the only one who uh, managed to take uh, Beng Hong Yang. And the uh, winner of Denmark Open took him to three games in the first round. It's not like he's 16, 10. Uh, uncommon with playing in Europe. He won these two tournaments, Denmark and French, back to back in 2017. Did uh, the Indian. And now he's in dire straits. Service over. 11, 16.
Wait, that's gone long. No, stays in. That was a super important 16. point for uh, Shrikant. 13. Third consecutive in this um, attempted comeback. Deception. That one went long. Service over. 17 13. It's approximately the same. Capacity here in the Glass Arena, perhaps a few hundred extra spectators compared to the uh, previous venue for the French Open, the uh, Stade Pierre de Coubertin in uh, Paris. Been uh, coherent to uh, Dambis play, whereas uh, Popo and Peace um, pretty much had the answers to the uh, questions asked by uh, Shrikant. Let's do it again. 19. Service over fourteen nineteen. I guess it's now never for him. Shrikant. Service over. Twenty match points, fourteen.
heavy solver. Service over. Well, a warm welcome back to the Glas Arena, where we've reached uh, match four on our schedule, which is a mixed doubles. And again, the crowd are going to get really involved here because it pits uh, Tom Chikel and Delphine Delroux of France 